Canoe is Lisa D. Hart here, Three Minutes with the Main Guide, and today we're going to continue our thing on tarps, and we're going to stay with the lines. And I know it's like, oh, everybody wants to see this tarp go up, and how unsexy, how pedestrian, the lines, the lines, the lines. But if you don't get this part right, none of the rest of it works. So today we're going to work on how you deploy these lines, and most importantly, how you wrap them up so that they never get frigged up in the pouring rain with a bunch of guests, paying guests standing around in the rain saying, how can I help? Oh, good times, lots of fun. We're gonna skip that for you guys, okay? Mike Patterson, Larry Totten, and Ed Eaton taught me how to do this. And every time I trim these lines to this tarp, I hear Mike Patterson's voice say, pay attention, this matters, pay attention. This matters. So now I'm going to show you how, you how you can deploy these lines and not have any of them tangle, and then we're going to trim them back to the tarp. Pull the loop, and it just plays out. It plays out, it plays out, it plays out, and there is not a tangle in the entire line. You can pull that loop and walk if you want to, but no matter what you, what you pull, it's going to play out and play out and play out, and it's never going to get tangled or frigged up, okay? So now I'm going to show you how to trim them up to the tarp. You're going to start at the tarp. A lot of people start at the other end. Don't do it. You're going to start at the tarp. You're going to get as close to the tarp as you can with your fingers, and then you're going to start wrapping. You're going to wrap it around, okay? at the tarp. Get about this much left. Turn it off your fingers, if you can see that, and start wrapping around the coil. Start wrapping around the coil. Okay, you can make that. You can make it nice and tight. I know people don't like their tarp lines stringing out in the bag. I'm going to show you a way to fix that too. When you get this much left, stick your finger like that and go through, and you're going to be left with a nice. You can pull that tight. You're going to be left with a nice tight loop, a nice tight loop at the end. Okay, when you have to deploy these lines. You don't have to find the end. You don't have to frig with it. You don't have to do anything. All you've got to do is pull this and, the, and walk and the entire thing is going to come out. Now, when you roll your tarp, and I usually do it from the folded end because it squeezes all the air out. If there's a bunch of lines, I roll, I, I roll it up. And then with all the lines here, before it's fully rolled, I'll tuck all that and then fold it and stick it in the bag. Okay, stay tuned. Next episode, we're going to put this tarp up. I swear to you we are. And we're going to have a, a, a nice session on how to put up the tarp and how to cook on an open fire under a tarp. I'm Lisa Dehart. You just spent three minutes with the main guide.